In this video, you will learn how to stitch a drawstring casing for a churidar. A casing is a hollow channel that holds an elastic band or a drawstring. It's a quick way to cinch the garment without making a separate waistband. Don't forget to watch the previous video to learn how to make the pattern and cut the fabric. To stitch the churidar, you will need your cut fabric, a sewing machine, thread, a pair of scissors, some pins, and a safety pin. Start by opening out the cut layers of fabric on the table. Align the layers with each other so that their corresponding notches coincide. We shall start by sewing along one crotch seam line of the churidar. Place the waist end of the crotch seam line under the needle and apply a reverse stitch. You may now sew forward along the length of the seam till you reach the corresponding notch near the crotch point. Remember, the seam allowance is usually half an inch. Make a reverse stitch to ensure a secure seam. Cut the thread. When sewing, always work steadily and carefully for consistency and to avoid unwanted stitches. Now, hold an unstitched end of the waist and make two quarter inch folds that taper off below the waistline as shown. This will provide a better finish to the opening of your casing. Starting from the end of the taper, stitch the folds in place, securing the raw edges of the fabric. Cut the thread. Repeat the steps to secure the other end of the casing. Ensure that the resulting finish is as shown here. Open out the garment with the crotch seam outside. To form a casing for the drawstring, you need to fold outwards at the notch marking the waistline. Press along the fold to set a crease. Now, make a double fold by turning in the raw edge as shown. Secure the fold in place with a series of evenly spaced pins. Hold one end of the fold to the sewing machine. Starting with the reverse stitch, advance to the other end, removing the pins as they approach the needle. Maintain a straight stitch, holding down the double fold all the way till the end. Make an inch long reverse stitch at the end of the line before cutting the thread with a pair of scissors. The stitch runs in a perfectly straight line maintained along the edge such that both folds are secured. Fold your pants seams out, making the crotch lines coincide. Align the two layers together, making the notches coincide. You can now sew the second crotch seam. Start the stitch by trailing onto the seam line upwards from just below the waistline. Reverse the stitch and continue along the seam line to the crotch point. Adjust the fabric if necessary and ensure that you maintain the seam allowance. Mm -hmm. 
end the seam with a reverse stitch as shown and cut the thread. You have now learned how to stitch a drawstring casing for a churidar. To learn how to make a hem, watch the next video of this series.